Hey, what's going on everyone? This is my second Facebook Live video. I did one yesterday for the first time. This is my second Facebook Live video. And yeah, yesterday was pretty successful. So I decided to do another Facebook Live video uh, for As Seen on TV Reviews. So we see two people join. Welcome. This is the Uncanny Brands Star Wars The Mandalorian the child, two slice toaster, uh, baby Yoda. This thing gets 4.1 out of five stars. It has 221 ratings on Amazon. And I thought it looked pretty cool, pretty funny. The best feature of this thing, and I'll show you, I don't know if you can see this, but inside there's a little kind of like mold. There, you can kind of see it. But it creates the image of baby yoda so if you're a fan of star wars you're a fan of baby yoda yoda maybe in, in general uh this may be the item for you so let me just read you a little bit more about this uh, it says bring baby baby yoda in your kitchen fun toaster accurately portrays the child from the mandalorian and this is an amazon uh description officially licensed star wars product uh toast the baby yoda on your bread get laughs as an image of baby yoda pops up on the toast completing his look Plus, it's fun to put jelly on whatever he is, lightweight and durable. And uh, yeah, like I, like I said, it has 4.1 out of 5 stars with 221 reviews. Let me just read the first review. It said one star. It says, this is the worst toaster ever. I will never purchase anything else from this company. The toast does not burn correctly. The toast gets stuck. The plastic smell does not come out until multiple uses. The toaster has sparks flying out of it. When you put the toast inside the toaster, it smokes. So that's the first review on Amazon. Uh, that does not sound good. I Hopefully it's not that bad. Um, but let me just look at the toaster. I guess first impression is this thing retails for uh, 40 bucks. Um, so it's pretty expensive. It's just plastic, lightweight. So you have plastic buttons here. Uh, you have a cancel button. Uh, you can adjust the lightness and darkness of the toast. And then you have the inside's metal, so that's a good sign. But yeah, let's test this out, see if it actually works. So here we go, I have some bread. I'm gonna try it on, I don't have uh, pieces of toast, but I do have uh, this kind of hamburger bun that I think will work perfectly. So let me just smash this like so. All right, so we have 21 people joining us. There was more yesterday, so I think maybe the dollar store, people are interested in the dollar store stuff. I don't know. That was kind of just a test thing, um, but maybe I should do more dollar store products. All right, so here we go. I'm going to put this in the toaster. Let me see. Kind of line it up with the molds here. All right, yeah, so there's molds on each side, and so here we go. Testing the Baby Yoda toaster out. Here we go. All right. Yep, let me just turn it up a bit. It's already heating up. No sparks, that's a good sign. There's kind of a weird smell coming out of this thing. So let me just move everything away in case it does start sparking. All right, so it's definitely, it's on. Yeah, there's a there's definite smell. So that, that reviewer was correct. It could just be a, the smell of a new product, but I wouldn't be surprised if the smoke alarm uh, starts going off. So if you hear the smoke alarm, uh, yeah, that, that's what you'll know it's because of this thing right here. All right, so let me just read some of the reviews. Uh, here's a three star. We got this because my old toaster beeped when it was done and my bird thought it was a song of her. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I don't know what that's about. Yeah, this is the first time I've watched bread being toasted. I'm excited. Yeah, it's, this is exciting. This is an exciting live video. Um, um, yeah. So we have 26 people watching toast. <laughs> well, this is live, live toast right here. This is entertainment. It's the toast, toaster channel. Okay. So here's one, it smells like burning rubber. The slots are too sh short for, the, for a standard slice of bread, which I think actually is the case. This, these have tiny, tiny little slots in here. 
So you you want to use like uh, I don't know, like Wonder Bread, that type of thing. Uh, it smells like burning rubber. The slots are too short for the standard slice of bread, and the picture comes out very small and burned. I expect so much better for this price, and for it being a Disney product, definitely will be returning. Oh, it's already done. Okay, yeah, Melissa, uh, want to see if the mold works? Yeah, me too. All right, so here we go. That didn't take long at all. Let me unplug it just in case. Because I might have to get this. Yeah, yeah I'm not sure how I'm going to get that out. All right. Get in a plate here. Let's see how many people we have watching this. We have 32. That's pretty good. This is the second live video I've done. Oh, I'm not going to reveal it right now. Let me, let me just hide it from the camera but there is a result, so that's always a good thing. Okay, so here's our toast. I can definitely say it did toast it a little bit, but here we go, I'll show you. Three, two, one, the reveal. Check that out. Is that worth 40 bucks? Cheap toaster, but that is the result. What do you guys think? Is this a, is this a good product worth getting for 40 bucks? All right, let's check the other one. This one's a little bit lighter, but yeah, it actually worked better than I thought it was going to work. This is a lot clearer. I've done some of these molds before and they don't really turn out all that well, but this actually, it's clear. I don't know if that, eh, I guess it kind of looks like Baby Yoda. Looks like a, maybe a, a raccoon or something or a dog. Or a bat, maybe a bat. But not, I mean, Baby Yoda, this. Um, yeah, so you have to decide. 40 bucks, is that worth it? Let's just see one of the positive reviews. I, while I'm, uh, yeah, I'm gonna read a couple other reviews. I'm gonna toast it. I'm gonna keep this live video going. If you're just joining me, I'm gonna try it on the, uh, we have the English muffin. Yeah, like I said, this is my second Facebook Live. Usually all my reviews are edited. So this is definitely a new thing, new experience. And so some of the reviews are going to kind of, I would say, longer and more <laughs> drawn out a bit. Because Facebook Live kind of allows me to do that. So yeah, because people are joining in and out all the time. So it could be a little bit different formatting or it's going to be different formatting than my regular reviews. Um, but yeah, it's kind of, uh, it's been fun. At least the one yesterday was a, a good time. All right, so we have 20 people watching. They're dropping off like flies here. Okay, so here's some... So it's so cute, but you can't fit a big piece of bread inside, which I can vouch for. It's very cheaply made, which I would say, I would say it looks good. It looks pretty good, but yeah, it's very cheap. This is plastic. This is like as cheap as it gets. Um, so upset I'm returning it. Uh, let's see, here we go. This toaster is fine for someone who likes dried out bread and faint image burnt in. So yeah, I would say these are the recommended reviews. I kind of just took the recommended reviews. Um, so it seems like a lot of them aren't that positive. But once again, that's what it looks like. The other side, it toasts pretty fast. <laughs> All right. Okay, so 23. Yes. Let's see here. Just keep. 
So some of that smell has gone away, which is which is good. It didn't it, initially. There was like a smell coming off of this. Some of the reviews said the same thing. It smells a lot better now, or maybe I'm just getting used to it. There we go. It's popping up here. All right. So this is an English muffin. And did it work on an English muffin? This is going to be a big test for this thing. Yeah, that's kind of what I thought. So didn't really, I mean, you can see a little bit, but yeah. If you get this thing, you're definitely going to be stuck with kind of like, you know, white bread, Wonder Bread, that type of thing. Anything like multigrain, it's just not going to work at all. But yeah, so I like to review or give my final conclusion on all the products that I review. I would say save your money. This is a novelty item. If you're a Baby Yoda fan and you want to collect every single Baby Yoda item available on the market, I would say go for it. But for 40 bucks for the quality of this thing, I don't think you're going to be happy with it at all. Um, I mean, that's kind of cool, but I don't think it's worth 40 bucks, especially since it's not going to be able to take most bread. Um, so I'd say pass, save your money, find something else. I mean, it's kind of collectible, but that's about it. So let me know what you think. Leave in the comment section. Do you like it? Is this worth it? Let me know. Is it worth 40 bucks? Um, seems like a lot of people are mixed on this thing. But yeah, once again, it's the uncanny brand Star Wars. This is the title Mandalorian uh, Toaster Baby Yoda. And it's $39.99. And it's probably, you'll find all, all sorts of prices probably. Let me just look in the bottom. Uh, Star Wars Empire Toaster. So I'm seeing a lot of different brand names on this thing. So I think the uncanny brands is the UB on the bottom right there. But there's all sorts of like brand names. I'm not really sure what's going on, but I'll, I'll just go by the listing of the item. Yeah, it's neat, but yeah, I agree. I wouldn't spend that much either. All right, well, uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Uh, maybe more dollar reviews, dollar store reviews. That seem to be a little bit more popular, but I'll just switch it up with different products. And this is just one. Uh, so gadgets, things like that. And thanks for watching, everyone. I'll see you later. Bye.